Today, we're talking about seven things to do before a cyber attack happens to you. I know you're probably thinking, our organization is already doing a lot within our budget and even need more money to spend on cybersecurity. With all of that said, here's a refresher for those already in process and a helpful roadmap for those that are just starting out on how to prepare for a cyber attack. Number one, backups and disaster recovery. This point cannot be stressed enough. We strongly recommend backups of your data. It's also a best practice to have the backup offsite from your primary network. We also recommend testing a full DR situation to ensure that the data backing up is reliable and can be recovered from. Number two, SIM. Security information event management is critical today. It helps assist with monitoring all activity and behavior on the network and within the data. Monitoring for phishing, suspicious logins, or host activity is essential to protect your network. Number three, remove local admin privileges. This helps reduce users' ability to accidentally install something that could harm the network and data. Removing local administrator rights from the endpoints could be a game changer for your organization and significantly reduce your risk. Number four, password vault and management. Having complex passwords for each login is a recommended practice to ensure users do not reuse passwords or share them with any unintended party. Number five, endpoint security policies. Having a robust endpoint solution is recommended in order to enforce stricter policies that prevent unknown scripts from running without your permission. This also allows you to enable script control and whitelisting and blacklisting of applications within your environment. This is essential for both servers and endpoints. Number six, multi-factor authentication. Enabling MFA on all devices and applications is a game changer to ensure the users logging on are the intended users. This can reduce account compromise by 50% or more. Number seven, user awareness training. Implementing user awareness training can strengthen your team's knowledge around identifying phishing emails before it's too late. Whether it's spotting those crafty looking emails or stopping those clicks of obvious free giveaways, this is a great defense against stopping attacks against your organization. So these are seven things you can do before a cyber attack to increase your defenses and put your organization in a better position to fend off the threats.